Good stuff. They're always doing good stuff over there at the Harley Davidson. But we're live in Tehachapi right now. If you're still trying to make it there to the uh, Mountain Festival, you still have some time. The rodeo just began at 6 o'clock, so it should be a really great night with gorgeous temperatures in the 80s right now. Downtown Bakersfield looking quite nice as well. Still plenty of sunshine to last us uh, for the next couple hours. We did hit that 100 degree mark right now, 101, 84 in Tehachapi and 93 over in Mojave and along Highway uh, 14. Winds are uh, stable right now. 84 in Tehachapi, like I said, 70 in uh, Breckenridge, and then there's a look over in the eastern desert. We did hit that 100 degree mark at Ridgecrest in California City, as well as here and in Delano. Our storm shield Doppler low is scanning clear. We are tracking a major high pressure system that's keeping things nice and stable and calm for us. That high pressure that we know and love that has been around all too much this summer. But there is some relief uh, on its way come about Monday into Tuesday. We are going to track a low pressure system that's going to bring us some slight offshore breeze and uh, low temperatures, a uh, good five degrees probably around the uh, valley floor. So 101 right now, we did hit a high of 102 today. And uh, your air quality index does look unhealthy for sensitive groups as long as this high pressure remains. But once the uh, offshore breeze comes in, that should improve our air quality just a little bit. However, though, our allergies are something you want to look out for if you do suffer from allergies. The chino pods, elm, and uh, grasses are going to be in the moderate to high range through the rest of the weekend, most likely. Uh, so just something to be aware of. How about the rest of uh, the state of California, though? 103 in, Rich, in uh, Fresno tomorrow, 74 in Yosemite, and 68 up in uh, San Francisco. Uh, light breeze off the central coast will make for really nice temperatures tomorrow, mid to upper 70s for the most part. And then 110 for a high in Palm Springs, quite warm there. 81 in San Diego and 91 in Anaheim with uh, some clouds lingering uh, through Sunday as well. Hundreds all across the valley floor tomorrow, but we should stay just at 100. And then upper 90s uh, for our mountain range, 89 in Tehachapi, though a little bit hotter than what we saw today. 87 in Fraser Park. And then over in our desert, we're going to probably uh, hit those 100 marks everywhere except for Mojave, where we're just going to be skimming that in the upper 90s. Overnight lows dropping into the 60s for many locations, so that looks great there. And then finally, for your seven-day numbers, first day of school right around the corner. Hard to believe, but we will be seeing a high of about 99 degrees uh, in the afternoon as the kids come off the bus, so dress accordingly. And then mid to lower 90s as we track that low come in through Tuesday, and that fresh ocean air is really going to cool us down into the lower 90s, so possibly a little bit below average. Uh, in our mountain range, we are going to see those breezy conditions and then lower 80s for the rest of the week. Absolutely gorgeous. Some clouds, though, Wednesday through Friday, and then it should be clearing out just in time for the weekend. Overnight lows in uh, the 50s. And then finally, over in your Kern River Valley, Valley. Breezy conditions through Tuesday. We're talking wind gusts, possibly up to 25 to 30 miles per hour, but it'll feel really nice. And cool temperatures down even into the upper 80s by Wednesday, lower 90s uh, for the rest of the week and into the weekend, and then overnight lows in the 60s. So for wrapping up summer and for many of the kids, you know, going back to school, things look really, really nice. So it was hot when they left school, and it's hot when they yeah. come back. To <laughs> yeah, hot, but not as hot as it could be. Gotcha. Okay. All right, Laura, thank you. <laughs>